Hey everyone out there, welcome to another episode of Uncensored Solar TV where we have nothing really to discuss or de to debate really of intelligence. It's just going to kind of be a fun episode where we're just going to go ahead and see what happens in a what if scenario for solar panels. So beneath me here, three stories down below, we have a Solfab 310. And um, what we're going to do is we're going to simulate basically uh, ice cube sized hail. Hail being ice, right? Makes sense. So I'm going to drop one cube first and see we'll have an impact camera down below to record that. And then I'm going to drop several to see what it'll click over uh, a repetitious area. It was a small area for, um, for some hail to fall. More than one piece at a time, really. So without further ado, cheers. There is one piece, one, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> one ice cube to simulate hail on a Silfab. And here we go with uh, several ice cubes for the fuller effect. There we go. And here we go with part two of uh, what happens when something falls on a solar panel. Right here we go. We're gonna this time I'm gonna increase it a little bit. I'm gonna go with patio block because let's be honest, we all want to see what this looks like in slow mo, right? So here we go. Nailed it. <laughs> So, um, this is what this is, uh, this, this did some damage. Uh, yeah, yeah, this that there that's a bad day. So, I guess the lesson to be learned is if it's raining cinder blocks, where the hell do you live now? But if it's raining cinder blocks, clearly your solar system is not gonna work out. But uh, interesting nonetheless. So thanks for watching the episode of Uncensored Solar TV brought to you by my amazing team here at Solar Wolf Energy. Thanks. <laughs>